Hi, this is Rick from EssentialPhotoshopElements.com. Here's a tip on how you can quickly find the center of your photo. Actually, not just the photo itself, but any layer that you might have inside of the document in Photoshop Elements. And this tip will only work, I believe, with Photoshop Elements 7 or newer, because before that, guides were not supported inside of Elements. So let's get started. Uh, the first thing we want to do is make our rulers visible. So if you go under the view menu and choose rulers and you can see the keyboard shortcut is shift command R on a Mac and it'd be shift control R on a PC. So we'll click that and now you can see we have rulers along the top and left side of our photo. And I'm going to open this up a little bit more and so I have a background, my background layer, and I have a layer called layer 1. So I'm going to click on my background layer to make that active. And then I'm going to go under the image menu and say transform, free transform, and the keyboard shortcut is command or control T. And you can see now I have a bounding box around my whole image. Um, you can tell because I have these little handles. There's eight of them all together. What I can do now is put my cursor over on my ruler and click and drag and it will bring a guide point out. And you can see when I get to the center handle, it just kind of snaps right on it. And that's the exact center of that photo and then I can do the same thing for a horizontal um, center if I click and drag on the top ruler and drag down and I'm dragging and boom it snaps right in there. So this is the exact center of image now. and now if I want to get out of free transform I can either click this cancel button here or I can just hit the escape key. So I'll click this and now you can see that those eight handles have gone away and I'm no longer in free transform. Let's get rid of these guides and you can do that if you grab your move tool and then just click and drag on them and just drag them back up into the ruler. So now I'm gonna make my layer 1 active by clicking on it and I'm going to turn off the visibility of my background layer. And this layer is basically just a, a part of the uh, background layer, but it's on a layer all by itself. So if I go into Free Transform again, and you can see it puts that bounding box right around that the image on that layer. And I can do the same thing, drag out my guides, and they snap right in there. And then I'll click on this to get rid of my bounding box. And here's my exact center. So I hope you found this tip helpful. To see lots more information on Photoshop Elements, visit my website at EssentialPhotoshopElements.com. Until next time, take care.